Soon after, he ended up going to a fortune teller to see his future. The fortune teller revealed three cards to him, the emperor, the tower, and death. Dakin began stalking Melita, his father's current love interest. He followed her all the way to a bar and touched the back of her neck. She quickly looked behind her only to find no one. Dakin thought to himself how small his father's world was and how it had no vision or scope. Dakin wanted something more. After finding Melita Garner, Dakin helped the red right hand in their plan to send Wolverine's soul to hell. He then decided to tell Mystique that both he and the red right hand intended to have Wolverine kill his own children after he escaped from hell. Shocked by this revelation, Mystique betrayed the red right hand afterwards. After sending several of his men after Dakin in order to get his attention, the leader of the Red Right Hand angry about Dakin's actions asked him why he told Mystique their plan, to which Dakin responded, Because I want it all. And the only way to have it all is to make sure that no one else has anything. The leader of the Red Right Hand then told Dakin to kill Mystique but instead he decided to use her for another purpose and invited her to dinner. During their dinner, they were attacked by Helverine who burned Dakin alive while Mystique was able to escape believing Dakin to be dead. But unknown to her it was all a setup as Helverine had other plans in mind for Dakin and allowed him to live while Dakin used this opportunity to disappear making the world believed he was dead while letting the red right hand finish their revenge against his father. Despite Dakin not being present to witness the success of the red right hand's revenge against his father, Wolverine had a vision showing him how Dakin had been involved in the Red Right Hand's horrific plot. Now believed to be dead, Dakin went to see the Fantastic Four where he obtained a glove from Reed Richards that produced energy claws, so that he would be able to conceal his identity and continue to be dead to the rest of the world without his claws giving him away. While on a ferry in New York City, Dakin learned from a newspaper story that Bucky Barnes, the current Captain America, had been the Winter Soldier.